hello hello guys <laughs> hello guys yeah yeah <laughs> 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 okay. <laughs> okay 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 guys here we have a uh, Lenovo. Lenovo yeah mm-hmm. so they are saying cannot put into windows i believe it's where it's turning on but it doesn't put into into windows uh let's go ahead i have a charger here let's see okay uh anyway it's, it's not charging us okay let's see again no lights uh, okay there's no charging light is it charging plug? Yeah, yeah, it's plugged in. Okay, guys, the PC is not turning on at all. Okay. Anyway, let's check a uh, charger. So what you do, you hold your charger like this, <laughs> <laughs> and then you take one probe. You touch the the inner part. Eh? Okay, that's my multimeter. Touch the inner part. Okay, wait. Okay, see, we have like more than 19 volts. I mean, more than 20 volts. So, let's see. 20.3 volts. Okay. okay. Let's plug it in again. As you can see, there's no charging light. I'll show it to you there's no charging light it means it's completely uh, it's completely dead always guys so what we do we remove everything okay the charging volt how much uh, uh, is there a certain voltage it's not supposed to be below yeah yeah obvious uh, I think the, the minimum it's uh, maybe 17 but the PC itself it needs 19 volts it's right in here okay this one is not 20 volts see oh yeah it's, it's right in here 20 volts Which and 2.5 amps and here we, 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 we're getting how many volts 20.3 yeah yeah, so it's, yeah it's okay yeah but in this case I don't think it should turn on with 17 volts I feel like it's too it's too low at least if it was 18 point something or 2 to 19 mm. yeah and again there is a maximum volt you can't maybe put 100 volts here over it should burn you understand can't put uh, yeah it's also maximum yeah, yeah exactly see the, uh, uh this thing guys <laughs> let me just show it to you okay see here uh this is 210 and and this is 240 volts mm. okay so what does this thing does is take the 240 volts it's convert it into 20 volts you see the 20 volts oh yeah okay yeah this is the one going to the one that goes to into a, the, PC. the pc exactly mm. it's coming from the 240 volts and this would choke you can't touch it like this it would choke you to to death this 240 volts it will electrify you. <laughs> yeah, obviously. Okay, this whole thing, it's um, it takes the 240 volts and converts it into 20. 20 or 19, depending on your laptop, even okay. to 5, to any volt. Okay, guys, so let's do some basic uh, troubleshooting. Let's remove the hard drive. Okay. I have my assistance here. Okay. Go ahead. Okay, let me pull the camera a little bit. See, yep. Okay. Okay hard drive is out let's let's remove the RAM the RAM is out and put inside 
Let us remove the network card. Okay. Okay, guys. I want to show you something. Okay, now can remove it. So, the, the network card. Uh, this is oh. the network card. It controls the, the Wi Fi. Oh. If you remove this, you won't have Wi Fi. Exactly. So, guys, uh, let's do this. Let's check our charging port. Cause, so, the best way to check if our charging port is working or not let's plug in the charger still there is no charging lights okay let me plug in the battery as well because so i want to check step by step okay let's see yeah, okay now we have a uh, charging light okay see so, so means the shorts was coming from the the hard drive or the RAM because now the PC is charging we do have a light let's, let's, let's turn it up side and down okay fine you can see me there <laughs> <laughs> Hello. okay let's see again okay. hope you can the see light. the light yeah, it's on. let's turn it on it's on as well and we do have a display mm. You see it's working. So what's this? Okay, so it means the our problem here. I think it's a, it's the hard drive. Let's put back the hard drive and see. Okay. Okay, hard drive is in, uh, and then. Okay, let's see. Okay, still we do have a, a, a light. Yeah. Oh, then what was wrong with this PC? What else would I move? It just needed oh. to be opened. <laughs> 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 yeah, okay, let's see. Okay, it means it's, it's doing this uh, funny thing. Okay. okay. The problem here is, is the hard drive, for sure. I think it's the hard drive, I'm not sure. Let's remove this hard drive. Okay, guys, uh, here I have this hard drive. Uh, usually I use this drive it's to test. test, it's for testing, so let's put it in, okay, okay, let's hold it, then press the button, PC is turning on, Windows uh, puts a uh, manager, uh it's failed right let's go let's go to bios okay hold la uh la and then la then you tap f2 i want to go to a bios okay take off the lights okay what does it mean here? EFI. EFI. Mm. Okay, guys. As you can see, the hard drive is faulty on this machine. So, I don't know. It's fine. Let's go to. Uh, this is the BIOS. Um, okay. Mm. 
secure port enabled right okay port mode let's change the port mode to legacy okay because i want to check this drive and then i say legacy first and then enter and then let's change again uh the uh, the boot priority so i'll show you on the screen okay guys okay yeah yep okay now let's press f10 with f10 yes yes Okay, as you can see guys now we can go through uh, through windows it means the problem is coming from the hard drive has the hard drive uh, I think is faulty yeah it's dead but the so problem is coming from the hard drive as you can see the PC is loading let me switch it off you can't fix the hard drive or you have to get a new one yeah you can but uh i prefer a new hard drive unless if you need maybe some you know some important yeah, data that. yeah yeah but the best option okay guys uh let me summarize this so the problem is the hard drive uh the hard drive is faulty 500 gig is toshiba it's toshiba hard drive it's faulty Okay, let me put a sticker. Oh, anyway, let's let's just put back everything. Give me the screws. Okay, so guys, I hope uh, you are learning. Anyway, this is just uh, I mean, this was just a basic, a basic, basic, basic. Okay. So press the subscribe button and like, <laughs> comment, comments are very important. If there's anything that you want to say or you should add more to the tutorials, feel free. <laughs> okay, sharp, sharp.